That's right. I have something to do here. Right, Ulbarak. Let's continue with your tale. The story so far. And so, Ulbarak triumphed in the arena of Advector's Hollow. Defeating Gustav, the Black Knight, in an epic struggle. Gustav shared the story of Erhard's past. A tale of a home lost while a king sat idly by. And of how Erhard swore revenge uh, upon the crown. Did you wield your blade only for revenge, old friend? What do you fight for now? That the thirst has been sated. Have you too lost your purpose? Ulbrick sought answers to these questions. Answer! He knew it would only come after a clash of blades. And so, Ulbrick arrived in Wellspring. Whoa. Or hard summer in this town. Best start asking around. I'll part ways with this man. As great as he is, he's getting low on someone's. Ooh. Your strength is a bit low, though. Gonna save here. Gonna save and I'm gonna try find someone to uh, bring along on this adventure. Oh, three, four. Let's get out of here. Anyone? Hello, hello. I cannot guide him either. Hello, guide. Are you strong? I guess I'll take you. Well, hello. Well met. Excuse me. Do you know of a man named Erhard? Aye. Tough bastard with the sword, you mean? Aye. Everyone here does. He defended our town from those goddamn listmen when it seemed like they'd overrun us all. Some folk here say, hey. Days of Savior, and you won't find me saying otherwise. Do you have any idea where I might find him? Great, I couldn't say. Don't say much, to be tr truth be told. I think. Is that so? In any event, thanks for the help. Okay, hello, friend. I ask you some questions. Hey. Can you help me? I'm looking for a man who goes by the name um, Erhard. Mm -hmm. Erhard? You'd be looking for the swordsman then. Mm -hmm. So you know the man? Of course. Aye, and I know him well. We all do, for the debt we owe him. Debt, you say? Mm -hmm. Aye. See, this town is plagued by damned lizardmen. Time was they were happy to skulk about in their lairs and leave us well enough alone. But then they took to setting upon travellers heading to and fro. A fine message was till their heart came along and started taking care of them for us. Well. So where is he now? Hmm. That I couldn't tell you. Don't see him much about in the streets. Gramercy. I see. Thank you for your help. Okay, well, let's listen to you, my friend. Well met. Excuse me, my lady. Do you know a man called Erhard? Erhard, sure. I suppose you're talking about the swordsman, right? Just so. That would be him. Oh, yes. A while ago, he saved one of the trade caravans from the lizard men and escorted here to the town safe and sound. He's a bit of a hero around these parts, though I haven't set eyes on him myself, mind. Well, you have any idea where I might find him? 
Hmm. Let him say. He don't show up in town that much. Thank you. That's unfortunate. Thank you nonetheless. Hmm. You there! Halt! If you don't mind, sir, we've got a few questions. Hmm? What about? Are you the one who's been wandering around town bothering people with questions about Lord Earhart? That I am. I see. I've been asking after him, yes. Hmm. Care to tell us why? Dot dot dot. What do I tell him? I have no inclination to lie, but from what the townsfolk tell me, Earhart's a veritable local legend here. What would they think if they knew I harbored a grudge against their hero and saviour? Oh? That got your tongue, sir? We can go somewhere private if you like. No, that'd be quite alright. As you wish. Ah, oh, yes, that might be for the best. What life do you live here, Earhart? Have you found a new purpose here? Have you found a cause for which to wield your sword? And if you have, might I still find the same? Hmm. Now slow down there. Let me get this straight. Your name is Ulbrich Eisenberg, known as the Unbending Blade of Holmberg, a realm that fell some years ago. And you're here to seek out Lord Earhart, who was once a fellow knight in that self-same realm. Just so. That's the sum of it. Well, fair be follow you, sir. Tis an honour to welcome a brother in arms of his lordship here in Wellspring. You should have said that straight away, sir. We'd not have done you the discourtesy of dragging you to a stingy room. The truth is... You might not like the rest of my tale so much. So much. Much has passed between Earhart and I since the days we fought side by side. Things are best not shared out of the streets where townspeople might hear. Indeed. As uh, yet, I trust you'll not be averse to share them with us, sir, Ulbrack. <gasps> Captain Bla Bale, sir! Mm -hmm. Leave us. I would like to speak to Sir Ulbrack in private. With your permission, Sir Ulbrick. I see. Of course. I have questions of my own. <laughs> I'm sure you do. Uh -huh. Then I'll go uh, inspect the man, sir. In fact. You should know that I'm the reason that Lord Earhart is fighting for this town. Mm -hmm. Is that so? We met by chance. I suppose you heard the stories about the lizard men. I see. I heard there have been attacks and travelers outside the town. Verily. A caravan was ambushed, but fortune smiled upon the merchants that day. Lord Earhart fought off the saints and escorted the caravan safely to the town. When the men told me his name, I recognized it immediately. I asked him if he was once a knight of the Hornburg. He did not deny it. Dot dot dot. And so... It was clear his journey had no destination, so I invited him to stay with us. At first he hesitated, but in the end, he agreed to stay and lend us aid, in so much as I can wear his exact word. I see. And he's been helping you fend off the instrument threat ever since? Yes. Indeed, the townsfolk are most grateful for his services. I suppose you wish to know where he is. You are former comrades, the two greatest knights of the fallen realm. I see no reason to hide the truth from you, do you? <sighs> dot dot dot. From the look of it, this town needs their heart. But I've come prepared to spill his blood if necessary. Should I confront him now? Is this the right time? Dot dot dot. Have you found a new cause, Earhart? Do you now wield your blade for a noble cause? A man of the sword must have something to protect. Is the answer you found? Dot, dot, dot. Mm. I have to meet the man. I must know. I must know if he's found purpose, the likes of which he took from me. And if so, 
Can he give me back what I've lost? No. No reason at all. Tell me where he is. Perfect. Very well. Lord Earhart is... C Captain! It's the Lizard Man! A whole horde of them! Where? God damn it! Heading straight for the town, sir! And in greater numbers than we've ever seen! Curses. What? Of Lord Earhart? Mm. He's gone to the cave, sir, fighting single handed. Last we heard. Mm. God's teeth. We can only pray for his safety. In the meantime, gather every able bodied man you can and march out to meet the horde. The town comes first. Once we've turned back the assault, we can go to Earhart's aid. Present. Sir, sir! Whoa. Would you let me help? Yes. Let you? We would welcome it. We'll need every sword we can muster. Prepare for battle. We march immediately. Present. Sir, sir. Hero Brick, follow God. when you are ready. Let us rendezvous on the lakeside trail. As you I'll wish. be there. <sighs> da, da, da. Mm. Protecting the town comes first. There'll be enough time later to find Earhart.